the network tab in chrome's dev tool help us to record or inspect a page a web page network activity which in general provide the detail of various requests happening in the backend now let us see how to use the network tab in chrome dev tool so in order to do that first i will open the chrome dev tool which i can do either by pressing control shift c on my keyboard okay or the other option is right click and then click on inspect okay so this way i can open the dev tools in my chrome browser okay so in this dev tool we are having one tab which is networks so this particular tab help us to record all the network activity of a web page which help us in making sure that all the resources are actually being uploaded or downloaded perfectly which generally means all the requests which are happening in the backend are either success or not we can check all those things in this network tab and in addition to that we can also inspect the properties of an individual resource such as http headers content size and so on so now let us take a look what i meant by all of this so if i do any activity on my web page for example i click on this create button you can see i can see whatever the network activity happening in the backend like i can see the resource calls which are happened as of now so basically these two calls happened okay and i can check their status in the status section and what type of uh, request it was i can check it was an xhr request which is xml http request okay and what initiated this request okay the initiator will tell us what initiated this request then what is the size of this resource okay and what time it took and in the waterfall basically it uh, uh, gives us a pictorial representation of this network activity where we can check uh, hovering over it we can check what what and all time it took and what kind of activities happened right so these all details we can check okay in addition to this we can also check the various headers and uh, like response what kind of activities happened for a particular request okay so if i expand this section a little bit just a minute okay so you can see for this particular request i can see the request method was post this is the request url okay then the status code was 200 for this request then also i can check what are the response headers what are the response headers after this request okay what were the request headers which were passed before this request okay okay and uh, is there any payload or something we can also check that for example if i click on this create button uh, create request okay here i can check even the payload which is behind this request so this way we can basically see all type of request or network activity which is happening in the chrome web application okay any web application which we are opening in this chrome browser okay and we can see all the resources all the request for any particular activity so this way you can also use your chrome dev tools to inspect various request involved in your application to find out the details of various request to see the various network activities okay you can also record you can see currently it is recording all the network activity you can pause this recording okay by clicking on this button even you can clear out all the recording as of now okay you can clear out so you can start the recording again by clicking on this button again red button and it will start recording the network activity again so if i click on some other button right now like if i click on this uh, your work tab you can see the network activity has started recording again so this way you can use the chrome network activity tab so that's all about this in case you guys have any question please let us know over the video comments we will try our best to answer those queries thank you